You're a... That's it. Call the region. Let's open a case. Oleg Sargevich, have they buried her yet so fast? Didn't your friend tell you? Which friend? The one you have to drive to the region, or did you think I wouldn't find out? Oleg Sargevich, I was honestly going to. You're a liar, Petya. Two tours of duty in no turn. Call him, let him come and present his evidence. What evidence? He knows what evidence. No way. It's obvious there was no one to kill her, but she's back at the morgue, and we don't know how long that's gonna take. Marina, the reason why I came is Jenna asked you to take Roma home. Yeah. See you later. Bye. Didn't they bury mom? Why? Roma, I don't know. Do you want me to take you to your dad? Or stay at my place? To daddy's. No water in the lungs. So the victim was dead before she fell in the river. She also has displaced cervical vertebrae. She was probably strangled. If you don't believe me, I can repeat the autopsy in front of you. No, Lara, don't. I'm sorry, Lesha. You were right. It's okay. Yes, Mikhail Yuryevich. What's going on there? Have you sorted it out? Yes. Tereshchenko was right. It's murder. And what about his dismissal? We'll reinstate him today, and we'll include him in the investigation team. Well, that's great. That lieutenant's a jerk. He couldn't tell a cat from a thief in my attic. He's completely useless. Come on, stop bullshitting. By the way, he was on my boat when he found the body. I assure you he'll find the killer too. What killer? Who would want to kill Christina? I mean, she didn't even have a fight with anyone. Yes. I disagree. She had a fight with Victoria the other day that almost tore each other's hair out. What was that about? A bread, please. I don't know. That's what people say. I gotta go. I gotta go make my nephew's dinner. Luda, are you afraid of losing? your job who isn't afraid these days i understand victoria treats you harshly i'm not complaining she's a normal woman so she only had a beef with christina i don't know luda covering up for a criminal is a criminal offense you could go to jail me for what you're not talking tell me and my pedia will stand up for you what are our leads on the killer well first of all well, Lyosha, here you go. Petya, thank you. Help yourself. Thank you, Petya. Dismissed. What about the investigation? Are you part of the investigation team? Oleg Sargevich. I propose to include Petya in the task force. He's a small cop. Yesterday helped us a lot. There are not enough people, but a lot of cases. We need to interview half the city. The matter is closed. I'm telling you, you can't come in here. I've got important business. They won't even let me in here. The whole town knows. The murder of my employee is a good reason for you. Wait in the hallway. We're in an important meeting. I've waited long enough. You should have reacted to the bullying against me yesterday. You have a duty to provide me with security. Victoria, first of all, 
I don't have the resources to provide you with security. Secondly, what makes you think Cristina was killed because she worked at your station? What else would it be? Or do you want two bodies? Give me the umbrella. Scandalous woman. Well, she's understandable. A coworker was murdered. She's getting threats herself. Did I say we weren't gonna do anything? Yura. Yes? Pick her up after work. Find out what's going on with her. Try to calm her down. I will. What about Christina's killer? We need to find your witness, find him and question him. Because it's very likely that he's not only a witness, but a participant in the crime. That's why he's in hiding. Did you call him? Aha, phone's off. Oleg Sargevic, let me turn to you. You may report. I accidentally spoke to Fedina's mom. He didn't show up at home. Put out an APB. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Son, take your seat. Marina. Sit down and drink to the repose of Christina's soul. Jenna? Although you'll never agree to it, you're a proud woman. Although, it's all because of you. Jenna, stop it. Why all of a sudden? Come in. If you hadn't let him live with you then, he would have gone to the capital, and none of this would have happened. Jenna, shut your mouth. What's this all of a sudden? I can't bury my wife properly, like a human being. It's all because of her. Dad, stop it, Marina is not to blame. Don't you dare shut your father up, go to the room. Roma, don't worry. Dad doesn't know what he's saying right now. You shouldn't have brought him here. I didn't know this would happen. Roma, come on, let's go to our place. You'll watch a movie with Andre, you'll play. I don't want to. Roma, what's wrong? It'll be fun. Do you want to come to my place? We can do homework and draw, yes? Patia, stop typing, you're using up all the paper, the whole town knows Fedina's face. What does he do after he's done time? Nothing. He's back with his mother. He worked at the factory for two years and then quit, traveled around the region, no criminal record. Probably he's do something weird. What are you sitting around for? Go put up some posters through the pole. When you do one, I'll do the next. No, through the pole. Oleg Sargevic, if it's no secret, who witnessed your conversation with Fedya? 
A lot of witnesses our mayor, Nikolai Kozanovsky, director of the hydroelectric power plant Arkady Semyonovic, there's been an emergency in town, a bridge collapsed. We all gathered at once, we had to solve the problem, Fedya drove up. Any other questions? Through one or through two? Dismissed. Yes, sir. Petya, can you give me a ride to the hospital later? I need to meet Larissa, the trauma surgeon there. With Larissa? You know what, Lyosha, you didn't hire me as a driver. Here are the keys, and drive yourself. You can take the car to the station later. I don't get it, why so angry? It's not anger, it's justice. You're a hero now. You'll solve the crime and go to the capital to get a new Ipolitz, and I'll just keep doing petty stuff. You've been telling you were a team. What's wrong with you? We really are a team. The main thing is to catch the killer. What are you rubbing it in my face? You should go about your personal business on foot, not in a company vehicle. Give me the keys. Hit! Larissa. Thank you. You really helped me out. Get in touch. You know where to find me. I won't get cocky. You've already sheltered and fed me, and you risked it for the cause. So please accept the gratitude of the police department. It's about me. I am risky lady. Thank you. Lesha. Yes. Maybe the investigation needs some more help. With housing, for example, for you. Live as long as you want, free of charge. I'll stay with Marina. I can't stay with you because of professional ethics. It's the right thing to do. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Where's Roma? He's sleeping. Let's go wake him up. I'm taking him home. Jenna, go home. Tomorrow after school, I'll bring him to you personally. Go home now. What home? I've come for my son. Jenna, you're in no condition to talk to a child right now. Go home. I'm in a normal state. Go home. Let me through. Can you go home? That's my son, Roma. Jenna, that's enough. Go home. Go ahead. Marina, go inside. Are you fucking nuts? Stand down, Jenna, you can't do that. Focus. I need to talk to you. I need to talk to you, too. That's very good. Let's go have a conversation. Just don't hit him. Okay, Marina, I won't hurt him. Come on. Let's talk. I promised Marina I wouldn't lay a finger on you. Do you understand? Jenna. What? My job is to find who killed your wife. That's what you want to, right? Yes. I have some questions for you. Go ahead. Okay. Where did Christina go that night? To a friend's house. What girlfriend? A Diana. Who's she? The mayor's wife. Okay. Why at night? Oh. 
I don't know. Okay. Well, was she in trouble? Did she tell you anything? What kind of trouble? We were living friendly. Of course you were friendly. You didn't even ask her where she was going at night. We have a high relationship. Any questions? Not yet. No questions. Jenna? Jenna? You can't trust them, not one or the other. Got it. Stop. What other one? I'm just saying. You can't trust women in general. Come on. As always, thank you. It's delicious. You're welcome. Let's go do homework. You can't play the console right now. Got it. And you, Piotr, I'll ask you to stay. I'm tired at work. Pedia, help me. Come on. You always ask me to help you. Don't you have any other helpers? Why are you so nervous? Did something happen at work? I'm telling you I'm tired. You know what I was thinking. What if Victoria killed Christina? Elvira, I've been teaching you for ages and you still don't get it. I've always told you that every crime must have a motive. Why would she kill Christina? They had a conflict. What kind of conflict? A big one. Christina even quit her job. Quit her job how? The day before she died. And there's evidence. What evidence? <sighs> Elvira. Elvira? Good for you. It's a statement from Christina that Victoria tried to destroy. You're mine now, Petha. How are the lessons going? Why are you looking at me like that? Tell me. Just be honest. Do you and Jenna know each other well? Why? Did he say something to you? Seems like he was having problems with his wife. And not just her. Who else? That's what I wanted to ask you. Is he having an affair? How would I know? It's odd that he would bring his only son to a woman he doesn't know. Why are you picking on me? I just have a very good relationship with Roma. That's the reason. Good night. I'm sorry. Good night.
Hi, Petya, how are you doing? Is everything all right? Yeah. Got any coffee? No, Oleg Sargevic, only tea. All right. Oleg Sargevic, may I ask you a question? Go ahead. I realize that I'm not part of the investigation team, but... I have information from a reliable source that Victoria had a conflict with Christina right before her death. I thought I'd check it out. A reliable source is Elvira. Yes. Hold on, the point is, she found a material witness and discovered a valuable piece of evidence here. A letter of resignation. Well done, Petya. I commend you. Victoria. Hello, this is Oleg Sargevic. Hi. Hello. Are you Roma? Hello. Exi. Is it because of you that mom wasn't buried? Turns out I am. Do you really think mom was murdered? Actually, Roma, it's a mystery of the investigation, and I can't tell you anything. I'm sorry. You got with meat? Yes. What's this with? Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese? Does Marina make it herself? Yes. Do you like Marina as a teacher? Yeah, she's cool, never yells at us. You're lucky, even when we're running around. But Elvira Pavlovna is mean. Elvira is a teacher. No. Principal, and Marina Petrovna is our class teacher, and everyone loves her. I understand. And when I was sick, she came to visit us and help with lessons. She came directly? It's a mystery of the investigation. Alexei, can I talk to you for a minute? We're tight on the number of investigative secrets. Do you have no conscience at all? Why interrogate a child? We're just talking. Of course we are, Roma. Finish your food. 20 minutes till the bell rings. Can I not go to school today? I want to go home to my dad. Of course you can. Let me take Roma. No need. Thanks. It's tasty. Victoria, what was your relationship with Christina Sashko like? It was great. Why? Your co-workers don't think so. Employees tend to talk about their bosses and make up gossip. I valued Christina as a professional and I liked her as a person. I told your Alexei all that. He came to see you. You didn't know. That's interesting. Looks like I'm not the only one with employee problems. We're still alive. You say you had no conflicts with Christina. I didn't. Then. Uh, how do you explain this?
The resignation letter. It was a misunderstanding. Christina came to me, asking for the day off for some bullshit. I had a terrible day because of your countrymen. They're getting on my nerves. I yelled at her. She took offense and filed a report. We talked and made up afterwards. Reconciled, but you signed the statement. I signed it in the heat of the moment. Then I changed my mind and put it in the shredder. Where were you the night Christina was killed? A home. Alone? I didn't kill Christina. Petia, I need your help. I have a theory, but Sajic won't like it. Actually, Sajic is working on my theory right now. You have a theory? Sergei didn't immediately tell you to fuck off with her. I told you I'm on an important case at the hydroelectric plant to interrogate Victoria, I found out that Victoria and Christina had a conflict. Let's say, by your logic, everyone here is an angel, and the murder is the work of outsiders. You're saying because she's from the capital, she's not a suspect. Yes. But statistically, it's most often the victim's family or close acquaintances who do the killing. Lesha Victoria is an acquaintance. Also true. What's your theory? Maybe Soshko's husband has a mistress and wanted to get rid of his wife. No way. No. Bullshit. Look, if Jenna had a mistress, the whole town would know about it. Besides, why kill his wife when you can just get a divorce? I mean, maybe he didn't want to split the assets, or maybe the mistress wanted to get rid of his wife. Either way, it's a delicate matter. They wouldn't talk to me. But if you, with your diplomacy, had been careful to find out. What's the problem? Let me find out. I'll do it. If I have some free time. Sure. Roma, why are you making so much noise? I'm sorry, Dad. It's just that Mom doesn't like. She didn't like the house to be messy. I'll come to my senses and help you clean up. Are you gonna drink all the time now? How are we going to live without mom? Sit down, Roma. How will we live? We'll live hard. Like real men but beautiful. They've brought in fresh pork. Will you take it to your lodger? Young and handsome. No, I won't. Is he merry? Toma, I don't have time for that. There's a lot going on in town. Don't tell me. I feel sorry for Christina. I think Anna killed her. What makes you think that? Who did? He came to get wine the night before she died. Obviously not for his wife. He was definitely going to his mistress. 
Don't make this up, Tanya. I'm not making it up. Apparently, Christina wouldn't give him a divorce. So he killed her. Bye. Hi. Hello. Antonina, this is for you. I don't have time for you right now. You doing okay? Yes, that's good. So? Oh, yes, Marina, it's good to hear from you. Jenna, hi, we need to meet. I'm ready right now. No better tonight, somewhere out of town. No one should see us. Let's do it around 9 o'clock p.m. by the river at our place. See you then. Great. So, did Victoria get arrested? Elvira, what does Victoria have to do with it? She's not involved at all. Why are you eating cold food? It needs to be warmed up. Elvira, you seem to know everything about everyone. Tell me, could Jenna and Victoria have had a romance? Who? Jenna is definitely an attractive man, but Marina is not on his level. Easier girls fall for him. So did he have a lover after all? Who? Elvira? Hiding important information from the authorities can lead to a sentence of three to five years. Do you want to be sent to prison? Who? Jenna? Marina? Please forgive me for yesterday. Jenna, have you told anyone about us? Marina, what do you mean? How could you even think that? I swear to you by Roma, nobody doesn't know anything. I'm sorry. I beg you not to tell anyone about us. Promise. I promise. Good evening. You're already home. I've been home for a while. Why do you keep lying to me, Marina? Your coat isn't even dry yet. You don't have a lover, you hardly know Jenna, but you secretly meet him at night to discuss his son's progress at school. Were you following me? You're not important enough for someone to follow you. I was following someone else and was surprised to see you there. Yeah. 
You don't seem like someone who would do such things. How long have you been in a relationship with him? A couple of months. That's what I thought. And what did you think? Tell me the truth. What did you think? That I'm a bitch and a lonely teacher who seduced her student's father. No. You don't look like a seductress. Thank you. But you also don't seem like the kind of woman who would have an affair with a married man. <sighs> Christina, she... Did she catch you that day? Yes. She asked Jenna to vacate the apartment and went to her friend Diana's place. He didn't want to get divorced and he had no intention of doing so. He was afraid of losing something in the divorce, or maybe Christina was threatening him with something. I don't know, no. No. Listen, if you think Chenna is the one who did it, it's not him. He couldn't do something like that because he's too cowardly. Besides, he swore on Roma, and he loves him deeply. I'm sure it's not him. Marina. Please. I beg you not to tell anyone about what you found out. I'll survive it. But it will crush Roma. I'll try as long as it doesn't interfere with the interests of the case. Thank you. I'm sorry. What are you going to do? Work? <clears throat> Oleg Sargevic, allow me to speak. What do you want? I have an important witness. Here. Elvira, good morning. Good morning. Did something happen at school? No. I'm on the Christina Sashko case. Confidential. Come in, have a seat. Go ahead. I honestly didn't want to get involved. Going through other people's black underwear is beneath me. But Petia... But Petia said that in the interests of the investigation, as a civic-minded person, I should say what I know. Today in class, we'll learn why it's important to eat more fruits and vegetables than chips and chocolate bars. Turn to page 5 and read the first paragraph. Hello, Oleg Sargevic. Marina, this is Yurkovsky. When are you free today? I have one more lesson. Why? We need to talk. Can you come to the office after class? Yes, of course.
Come on, come on, faster, faster. Faster, faster. Let's get in the car. Faster. No crowding, don't panic. Is everyone in? Give me my bag. Nikolik, here. Feet up. Come here faster. Is everyone seated? Yes, all of them. Get your hands off. Let's go. Looks like everyone's seated. Lesha. What's up with your version? Nothing. What about yours? Mine? Nothing with mine either. Citizens, be careful. Let's get going. Marina Petrovna. Would you like some tea? No, thank you. Tell me about your relationship with Jenity Sashko. Has Alexei told you everything yet? We're investigating a murder here, so answer the question. Do I have to remind you of the question? Yes, I was dating Gana, but we broke up. How long ago? The day Christina died. Varia. I'm coming. Finally, the flood is here. Did you reach Michalik? No, I didn't. He's drinking. What to do? I don't know. Let's wipe it up. And what Marina finished today already? Dating anyone. Also call the teacher. Do the police know? Yeah, they're all the first to know. Yeah. Just don't tell anyone. Uh, sure. Marina, I know you're home, Marina. What's this all about? Explain it to me like a human being, what happened? Give me the umbrella. You didn't have an umbrella. I didn't. 